That's a seven inch on In the Red Records from the bass holes. Tried to get a session out of them a few weeks ago, but it didn't work out. But we'll have another go at it next time they're in the country. That's Hey OJ. Uh, one of tonight's sessions, though, does come from half Japanese. Jad Fair on vocals, Steve Petter on guitar, John Sluggett guitar, Mick Hobbs guitar, Dallas Good on bass, and Gilles Reader on drums. This is The Feelings Get Stronger. <laughs> Another from half Japanese now, this is Den of Sin. It's all so common and wise when the first man in the verse for I. Yeah, you got me, no lie, the best, yeah, give it a try, I'm gonna say, and so we went. I mean, how I'm both then and now. I mean, what I'm at, and what I'm at. A hearty wow, I will always have a This is the way, it's that way to go, and now I say, never say no. This is our day, the fat we owe. Give me my pay, because I say so. How do you feel? Here's a rose, here's a real. What can it all mean? That's half Japanese in session and den of sin. (laughs) 
Just that nice Terry Edwards with his scapegoats from the LP on Stim Records. My wife doesn't understand me. And this is called, I don't know what it's coming from, where it's coming from, rather, but I dig it. And uh, before that, I don't want to say, rather unpleasant coming out of my mouth. What on earth did that come from? Uh, before that, it was uh, Blue Omer, spelled O-M-A, on Corrode Records, and uh, uh, a track called Upward Spiral. And that's a hear from Kevin O'Shea from Birkenhead, talking about Chemist Bay, actually, uh, run by Chris Lawler, of course, trying to organise my life so that I can go and see them play, and even do a piece about them for the radio, if I possibly can. But uh, amongst things that Kevin says is this. He says, uh, hold on a second, where is it? Remember not to let Billy Boy Bragg drift away, get him in for that session he promised to do. Uh, we'll be on hand. Well, funnily enough, we've done precisely that because Billy Bragg is going to be playing live in the studio in this programme next week, along with sessions from uh, Orteca and Deluxe Unconvinced, improvised garage rock from Boston. It says, uh, next Saturday, the 14th, we've got Biss, their debut session for the programme, and uh, Quick Space Super Sport. So two good programmes next weekend, I'd suggest. Uh, what have I got for you now? Oh, yeah, another one from Half Japanese. This is Do It. <laughs> Half Japanese in session, and that's called Do It. And a postcard from occasional correspondent uh, Bob the Chiropodist, in which he mentioned a track from the LP The Makers of Smooth Music, MSR Madness Volume 2. And uh, the track that he mentioned, actually, that he cared for was one... What was it called? Doesn't matter what it was called, anyway, but... Uh could it have been How Long You Stay? No. Was it Makers? Was it no. Watch Johnny Carson. Uh, convertibles and headbands. But anyway, it doesn't matter. The one I'm going to play you now is, uh, and indeed uh, Bob, is the Watusi Wingding Girl. Think you're going to like it. <laughs> Babylon, and after the news, it'll be blue and red. 97 to 99 FM, Radio 1, Newsbeat. The jury in the Rosemary West trial has heard horrific allegations about the murders she's accused of. Mrs West denies murdering 10 girls and young women with her husband. The prosecution says their victims were subjected to appalling sexual abuse and then killed because they were thought likely to tell. Labour's deputy leader John Prescott has wound up the party's annual conference with a call for Tory voters to switch to Labour. Meanwhile, Tony Blair has admitted that the most risky moment of the conference was when he was exchanging headers with Kevin Keegan. I didn't practice at all for it. It certainly was the most dangerous moment of the week. It was also the most enjoyable. But I have to tell you, it was a fluke. Thirteen people have been hurt in a bomb explosion in Paris. The device made from nails packed into a gas canister was hidden in a litter bin near a metro station. A prisoner serving life for shooting his girlfriend's father dead and raping her sister has starved himself to death in a Buckinghamshire jail. Gary Bland had been on hunger strike since the end of June. 
26 tonnes of whisky is floating about in the Irish Sea after a freight container was washed overboard. It broke free from its ties in heavy seas on a ferry heading for Haitian. Radio 1 Newsbeat, I'm Catherine Mitchell. Radio 1. More music. God, I hate this town, but I like that one better. Before that, it was Panasonic on Blast First Records from the LP Vacchio, and Graf was the title of it, and there's a say a session from them coming up at some stage, although not just yet. Uh, in session tonight, though, half Japanese. Japanese in session, and that's called This Is Our Day. If you're a regular listener to this program, then you'll know that appalling links are a kind of speciality of the house, I'm afraid. And this next one is as bad as any that I've ever done in my life, and it occurred to me while I was putting the program together, and at the time it seemed rather clever, in the same way that I think it was on Tuesday night, I woke up about three or four o'clock in the morning, and I thought, I've got a great opening paragraph for an autobiography, if I ever get around to writing one down. And uh, actually did get up and go downstairs and write it down on a piece of paper downstairs, standing there shivering and naked in my room. And uh, typically, of course, and it's usually the case, I suspect, when I read it in the morning, it wasn't at all clever or funny, <laughs> and uh, was immediately rejected. But uh, this link, I thought, was really rather special. The uh, bass player, of course, with Half Japanese, as I mentioned earlier on, is Dallas Good. Dallas Good, but Fort Worth better, better, and I got it wrong. And uh, this is recorded at the Panther Hall, Fort Worth, Texas. It is terrible, and a complete waste of time, really. All right. <laughs> All right, ladies and gentlemen, thank you very much. Um... This is Half Japanese in session. What about me?
Straight into the point, half Japanese, what about me? And uh, this afternoon's sessions between 5 and 7 on Radio 1 come from Manson and Tunic. And next weekend, let me tell you again, it's uh, Orteca, uh, Deluxe Unconvinced, and Billy Bragg live in the studio on Friday night. And then next Saturday, Biss and Quick Space Super Sport uh, in the afternoon between 5 and 7 again. Uh, right, 60 foot dolls. Uh-huh. 